pulse oximetry measures oxygen saturation in the patient's blood. Now, an altered oxygen saturations are a late sign of respiratory distress. Initially, the body will try and compensate for hypoxia by increasing the rate and depth of respirations. By the time the oxygen saturations are decreasing, the patient is usually very compromised. Now, your normal oxygen saturations are 97 to 100% room air. Oxygen saturations above 90% correlate with very low blood oxygen levels and require urgent medical review. Now, if your patient's oxygen saturations are low, you will usually notice other signs that the patient is short of breath, such as increased respiratory rate and effort. To measure the patient's oxygen saturation, make sure to check if there are no fake nails, as it does affect the reading. Now turn the machine on and wait for a few seconds. Usually it will also turn on once you put it onto the patient's finger. Make sure to update the patient of the result. Then make sure to immediately document on your general observation chart. And that is how you check your patient's oxygen saturation. Now to learn more about your OSCE, make sure to subscribe and enroll now at AURN Pathway. Mm -hmm.